Prophet وسلم, came out of the house carrying Hassan and Hussein. Again, he's carrying his two grandkids, one in each arm, and he's kissing them. Kissing this one, kissing this one, and then the people see him. And so somebody says, and they make a remark, they kind of make a remark, and they say, O oh, Messenger of Allah, you, you love them. And the Prophet وسلم, said, Whoever loves them loves me, and whoever hates them hates me. Right? These kind of messages of how important is our family to us? Who is the most beloved to us? Yani, when you see this level of love, it wasn't just for the ummah, the community, the projects, the fame, the whatever. It was this concept of charity starts at home. Like if your kids and your grandkids and your blood kin are the ones that are able to say, I feel loved by this person, then that's the proof in the pudding. Do you see what I'm saying? And I know there are difficult relations, and I know that there's hard stuff, and I know that there's people that, you know, that, that have a really rough go with each other. I, I get that. That's the field of work I do. I get it. But I also want to say that it's um, something very special when you're able to start to melt some of that, or even just start to figure out what are the roots of that. What, what are the roots of it? Was it ignorance? Was it arrogance? Was it somebody who themselves has been hurt and so they continue to hurt others because they haven't healed? Like, what is the root of that? Because when you can start to really show love and give love, love continues to reciprocate over and over again. And when, the ne when it transfers to the next generation, then it's going to propel itself forward.